Oh, I should have went and got. Hey, Japari. I need to read comments. Can you go downstairs in that I backpack? I need the business phone. Hello, hello, hello. Hey, 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 girl. Hey, hey, hey. Hello, 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 everyone. Let me wipe this camera off. It's just cloudy. Hello, 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 you guys. Hey, TikTok. Hey, YouTube. Hey, Facebook. Hey, Busy Bees. Hey, everybody. I'm live everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. It's not over there? Okay. Hi, guys. That's give, my daughter. Give mommy money so we can be rich. Oh, my God. Y'all, she said, give me money so we can be rich. Okay, go over there. Please. Thank you. Subscribe. She said, subscribe to us. Go over there, please. <laughs> These kids are a trip, y'all. We're going to do the Dollar Tree Fountain tonight. We are going to do the Dollar Tree Fountain. I have, um, right, hey, Shamika. I have um, created the um, template for this, and we're going to do it together. Um, a bunch of y'all are having problems. So hopefully, this will help you out with some of your problems. Hey, Tanika. Shameless plug. I love it. So I don't know. Over here on um, Facebook and um, YouTube. I think that's where I'm live at over here. I don't know um, your name unless you go up to the top and you click um, that I can see your name, that you I have permission, that StreamYard has permission to see your name. I'm going to try and look in my free Facebook group to see if I can see you guys' name that way. Um, if you guys are not over here on TikTok, part of my free Facebook group, you guys can go on and join where you guys can see this live um, repeatedly because... It's on repeat over there. Y'all can re-watch it, right? Oh, there we go. I see y'all. Hey, Janice. That's Cora saying shameless plug. <laughs> hey, Cora. What is going on? Hey, Annie. I'm going ahead on and enjoying that. Um... We're gonna get started with this um with this fountain. So let's let's talk about these fountains, okay? <sighs> Thank y'all for the support, first of all. Let me say that. Thank you for the support. You guys have supported me, but these fountains have been hard to make a template for. But I just answered a problem. Like y'all, everybody was like, oh my God, we can't get the measurements, we can't do that um we can't do this so i was like well let me try and make a template to try and help you guys right so that's what i did and thank y'all for supporting me i appreciate everybody so the first template that i made um janice you're gonna go up to the top underneath my name and you're gonna give um, Streamyard permission to see your name i see you I see you um, over here on TikTok. That is the name of my free Facebook group. It is Busy Bee Crafters, Photoshop, Party Favors, and Sublimation Tutorials. You guys can join us on over there. Make sure y'all answer the questions. You'll be able to join us. We are some dope crafters over there. We love to have fun. And um, you guys can see this on replay because y'all know on TikTok, TikTok does not give us the replay, man. I have no idea. I always give permission and it doesn't show my name. Who was that? Cora. Cora StreamYard just don't like you. No, I'm just joking. I love Cora, y'all. <laughs> so this is, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you guys the difference between the two. This is the five below fountain. Something got on here. This is the five below fountain, okay? So it has a back wall and the sides wrap around, right? So I gave you guys one piece and the sides wrap around it. 
okay hey rochelle then it has one other piece on the front and the sides wrap around so that's two pieces then it has a flat top that's three pieces right and then it has a front right here that's four pieces five six and seven so the five below has seven pieces to its fountain okay um a lot of you guys were in my inbox and you like well you did a fountain template hey andrea hey cars creations y'all said i did a template for the five below one but what about the dollar tree it's not a dollar tree around me and a five below around me a lot of people are like it's not a dollar tree it's not a dollar tree around me i'm sorry five below around me we can't get the fountains but we want to do them and we can't figure it out even with my template some people were having difficulties so i said well let me just go into my free group and help you guys out and teach you guys how to to do this fountain right hey TikTok, it's a lot of y'all on here can y'all tap the screen for me give me some love share me out come on y'all i'm about to give y'all free game on these fountains okay all right so this is the five below fountain the dollar tree fountain looks very very similar y'all very very similar and i'm going to show you the differences um, it, it's some actually really, really, really big differences between the two. Um, this template was very, very hard to do. Very, very hard to do. Hey, Deanna. Hey, Marcia. Andrea. Hey, Trish. Joanne. What's going on, y'all? So very, very similar, but this one was very, very hard. Look it's the top this top is flat y'all can see this top is flat this top is flat this top has one piece two pieces three pieces four pieces five pieces y'all see that one two three four five just for the top the right is different from the left okay so i was just like i know i did some tutorials on the five below one but i gotta come back and do one for the dollar tree one because y'all getting hung up y'all getting hung up so um just to give you guys some help we're gonna do this one now i have um measured everything out i took them and i put them up against it made sure that it fit but i didn't i never put it together let me put you guys down but i never did put it all the way together okay so we're gonna put this together i don't know how this is going to go with the weave at the top okay i don't know how this is gonna go with the weave at the top but we just gonna roll with it because this is some people's only choice so we're gonna get it so first let's start off with the paper i use sticker paper from thank y'all for the likes thank y'all for the i'm still only got one share um i use the sticker paper it's called j and j packaging from um amazon j and j packaging from amazon now it told me it was waterproof right but then when i got it I was like this is not waterproof because i did my first five below fountain it just wasn't waterproof it wasn't it wasn't proofing y'all <laughs> hey you keila hey lisa um what happened was is i went on to notice and i did a little research that my ink is not waterproof the paper can be waterproof but your ink is not waterproof so what do you do when your ink is not waterproof you got to seal it you got to seal it with something so what i did was is i went and got some triple thick in a spray can 
This comes in Rust-Oleum, and it also comes in the Krylon brand. The Rust-Oleum and the Krylon brand, y'all. I put this up on my TikTok now. So if y'all are following me on TikTok, y'all will be able to see this. Hey, Judith. Um, you guys will be able to, to be able to see it. There is a certain way that you have to spray the paper. Y'all, here's your paper. You need to go real lightly like about five or six times i think i only told y'all in the in the TikTok video uh, two or three times but like i'm saying five or six times and when i say hey charmonique very very lightly when i got too heavy-handed because i'm impatient crafter right so when i got too heavy-handed i had to go get a new piece of paper because it soaked through it got spots on it it got like different things were just started happening, right? So what you don't want to do is um, is spray all at once. You just want to real lightly mist it, give it about 15 minutes. Lightly mist it again, give it 15 minutes. That's what worked for me. Once it's sealed then and dry, then you're ready to start putting this thing together. Now, now let me move this five below one to the side. So let's talk about this one from the Dollar Tree. Okay. Let me, let's talk about this one. Um, Wandra, can you drop um Shabby Sheet? Can you drop the free Facebook group so they can join the free Facebook group for the replay, please? Um I put a disclaimer. So when you get your template, it's going to be two downloads. Hey, Veronica. Oh, Valencia. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't see you. So you'll get two pages. Okay. You're going to print both of them out on sticker paper. This one and this one. We're going to cut it out and do it tonight. Thank you. We're going to um, we're going to cut it out and do it tonight. And you're going to see how to put this thing together. Now, I put a disclaimer here at the top. I'm going to read it to y'all. It says, top pieces. So this download right here has just the top pieces on it. It has one, two, three, four, five top pieces. And it says, this fountain does not have straight lines. They are slanted. So the template is slightly slanted. I've used multiple shapes in Photoshop to create, to create. Do not put the text too close to the edges and use an X-Acto knife to trim the overage. Okay. And it says, join my free Facebook group for the free tutorial. And I gave the name of the Facebook group down there. And you guys are going to see what I mean. I don't know if y'all can see it on here, but I had to put so many shapes together. It's like jagged edges there, y'all. Y'all see the jagged edges? I don't know if you'll be able to see it so good. Facebook, it'd be hard to see on this camera. I don't know. But they're like jagged edges on that edge. Just cut it as straight as y'all can. The reason being is because I'm holding it straight right now. One of these sides are larger than the other side. One is bigger on one side. One is smaller on the other side. So on the smaller side, I had to keep it consistent and I had to make it big, just going all the way through. So you're going to have a little bit of overage. And when you have that little bit of overage, just grab your X-Acto knife and you're just going to have to cut off that overage. That is why I told you, you cannot get too close with text on that edge. Right, Judith? So that is going to be your issue when putting these together. It doesn't have to be an issue if you know what you're doing, though. So we're going to start cutting this out. And y'all talk to me. We're going to start cutting this out and putting this together. Now, this I did not um, 
I did not uh, seal. I didn't seal it because I had a lot of trial and error with this stuff, trying to spray it to get it right. So it's about, oh, my dog loves that song, song sound. So here he comes. So um, with the trial and error, I'm, I'm about out. <laughs> I need to go and buy some more. And I was out yesterday and I totally forgot. Totally forgot to go and get some. Hey, Joanne. Hey, Patricia. Now, if y'all are going to be able to see this, y'all see that? Them sides. This is a slanted side, and this one is more straighter. This one is more slanted, and this is more straight. And the reason being, you'll see in a minute. You will see in a minute. A lot of people have started selling the template that I've seen on Etsy. You use self-adhesive laminate. I've seen some people do that, Lakeisha. How do you like it? Do you Are you confident that it's not going to leak if you give it to your customers? So... I seen some people use that laminate. Did anybody else on my live have y'all used the laminate or did y'all use a spray sealer? Y'all tell me what did y'all use? I'm like it failed. I'm gonna put my little pieces up here on the top. I ran it for a while and it worked great. Good, good. I mean, I haven't heard anything bad about it. I guess I just chose to use the spray. So if you have done one of these, have you done the Dollar Tree or the Five Below version? Tell me that. Or are you waiting to do this? Are you ready to do it? Jenna said she used the laminate and so far so good. Lakeisha, you did. So did you do it? Were you successful in covering all sides of it? Or did you have any difficulties? Okay, mommy says she's waiting. I tell you what, the viral part of these are dying down. But I mean, they're still wonderful gifts. I can tell because my sales have um, started slowing down. They haven't stopped on this template, but they have slowed down. So I was like, okay, you know how things catch away for a minute in the crafting community and everybody runs out and gets it and does it right quick. Either they can't find any in their neighborhood <laughs> or they just stop doing them, you know. Got one more piece to this top. Yeah, Lakeisha, get my template. It's going to fit perfectly. Rochelle says she did five below as well. The five below one is so much easier. Joanne said I used the spray, but not sure if I did it correctly. So, Joanne, like some of these pieces that like I'm cutting away now, go spray one of the pieces, let it dry, of course, and then go run some water over it. And then see. So you're like using a little tester because you got a lot of scraps that we are using that we're, we're cutting these out. Um, Lakeisha, I'm sorry. Yeah, Lakeisha, at the top of my um, of my page is my website. So you can go and order and it's an instant download. <clears throat> Hey, Karina. All right, let's get the hardest part of this thing done, which is the top. All right, let me put you down here so y'all can see. I got this little towel, raggedy towel on my thing. And TikTok, I need to put y'all down too so y'all can see. Okay, I think we're good. Everybody can see. 
Like my kids might walk by. So let me move my little stand there. So they can have some privacy. Hey, Shanna. Was you, Nikki? No. Where was you at? Where did you go looking for me at? You're welcome. So this one right here goes on the top, I think. Look, I'm like, I think. And did y'all see what I did? I had it on this way at first. I just had to flip it. And it goes this way with the butterfly on this side. So once you cut it out, because it's so specific, y'all, so specific, right? Once you cut it out, if I flip it this way, oh, Nikki, I'm on the busy bees too. Oh, you're in the busy bees. See, it doesn't go right. So make sure that you flip it the right way. Like I told y'all, one side is bigger than the other side. So you have to be at, when I created these shapes, it was, it took me six hours, y'all, just to get it right. Thank you, Janice. This is the one from the Dollar Tree. This is the fountain from the Dollar Tree. I like this. This is like vinyl sticker paper and it comes right off and it's forgiving. So I'm going to stand up as I usually do just to eye it so I can like line it up right. So there we go. There's our top. Now, there's a little overage on that side. This is what I'm talking about. And that's okay. You can get overage there and you just take this X-Acto knife and we're going to cut that side off. Okay. This particular template doesn't have anything on it though. I didn't put any names or anything like that. Yes. Yes, Shanna. Thank you. All right. So here's this one. Does this go on the front? It does. So a name or something or a date, I'm going to say a date can go up there at the top. Maybe the um, date or something. Let's stick that one up at the top. No problem, Shanna. People were having such a hard time and I just wanted to, you know, help because it just took so long, but I wanted to really help y'all because people were struggling. They were like, we went out and bought these things and I seen these Dollar Tree templates. A lot of people were just, um, they would um, glitter the top of them because they were not getting it right. And I've had people in my inbox and I've had people that were um, just frustrated and in my email, right? Just frustrated. And I'm like, oh, nah. So this one is going to go on this back part here. Oh, thank you. Stick this one up. So I wasn't sure if this weave was going to show through, but it's not showing through. It's pretty good. Let me see if I put it this way. Is it any better? I don't remember. Oh, I think it's this way. Y'all, like I told you, this thing is crooked. It is. Y'all can even see how crooked it is. Y'all see how that's not even lined up? Y'all see how it's more on this side than on that side? Do y'all see that? I mean, the customer's not going to see this. They're not even going to pay attention. But as a crafter, I pay attention to everything. I, I see everything, right? But if you look at it, if you are looking at it like down in your lap right now, I can tell you it looks like it's crooked. And it is. And it is. This is um, j and &J packaging from Amazon. It's vinyl sticker paper. If you want to take a picture of that, j and &J packaging sticker. It's... um. Printable vinyl sticker paper. 
<laughs> Janet says it looks like you drew it. Hey, it works. It works. But you can't tell. Like the customers don't know, right? Lakeisha said I glued a pearl ribbon on top and was totally frustrated with it. A lot of people were. And I'm like, oh, no. Nah. And then, y'all, these sides, I went and did this side. And I went to go and just do this side. I'm like, wait, it's not matching. I had to mirror it for the each side because the peaks are different on each side. I'm like, man, this is really, really giving me to run for myself. But I was like, I'm going to figure this out. So we're going to put this one on the side. Well. Now, y'all see this overage right here? Y'all see the overage? If you tuck this up underneath and then fold it over, y'all will see it. Watch. It won't look like it's sticking out. That's a key for you guys. So put the tops on first and then the sides, right? So it's kind of sticking out. And then just roll the sticker paper over the top. Roll it over. Or you can cut it off with your X-Acto knife at this problem. Right, Shanna? It's the, actually, let me tell y'all something. Hey, Fanchon. I drove around for days looking for this. And I found out. The only people that have this is the Dollar Tree Plus. And I'm like, I've never seen a Dollar Tree Plus. What is a Dollar Tree Plus? Dollar Tree Plus. I'm just doing the other side, y'all, same way. I'm going to tuck it up underneath that spot. And this side doesn't really have anything to roll over, right? It's just almost just on there but I'm just gonna roll it. And this, because I don't want it to get right there, I'm gonna cut that off, y'all. I'm trying to see what you can see, I mean, on Facebook. Let me see, hold on, I can't see. <laughs> this little piece right here needs to be cut because you don't want it to roll over to your front, right? So I'm literally, Going to set this down, get my X-Acto knife, and just trim it. It's the only way. Okay, I'm at the wrong angle right now. Y'all know what it is. So the Dollar Tree, I didn't know what it was either, Angela. So if you go to my TikTok, you'll see it has a big in the in the middle of it, in the middle of the store, it has a big round thing that says Dollar Tree Plus items. So I drove around so many Dollar Trees and they were like, that's a Dollar Tree Plus item. That's a Dollar Tree Plus item. You can order it online or there's a Dollar Tree Plus like 45 minutes that way. And I was like, y'all suck. But I was in the area. And I was like, let me go try this Dollar Tree Plus. So I went to go try and found it. And um, it's a Dollar Tree that sells everything over a dollar twenty-five. Is what it is. Hey, Catherine and KK, Family Dollar and Dollar Tree, Janice. So your family and Dollar Tree is mixed together, or are you saying you have both of those? Yeah, um, Shannon, go to my TikTok and you'll be able to see um, what it looks like inside of the store. Because on the outside, it just says Dollar Tree. You would know that it was a Dollar Tree Plus. Everyone that I, Dollar Tree I went into, they're like, we're not a Dollar Tree Plus. And I'm like, well, what is that? You know? So, hey, you live and learn sometimes different things. All right. So I do have some overage here in the back. 
but I'm going to wait to get this back piece on first. All right, so we're going to cut some more. Let's cut some more. Cut, 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 cut. And again, don't nobody call me and say these shapes ain't right. That's because the, the fountain you chose is crooked. Now, y'all know I always joke around and tell y'all because I don't ever cut straight. I got a crooked eye. <laughs> if y'all know me, I tell y'all on every live when I'm cooking, cutting something, I can't promise you that it is spot on because I don't know how to cut. I'm a crafter that cannot cut straight. That's probably why I teach Photoshop courses because I can't do this. Cutting is not for me. I even have a cutting board and I be messing up. That's ridiculous. It's mixed. So Janice says she has a mixed half family dollar, half dollar tree. That's why I have here too. I have to travel just for Dollar Tree. So wait, I've never, hey James, hey Deborah, I've never heard of that before. Has anybody else on TikTok, have y'all heard of that? A Dollar Tree and a, a Family Dollar together? I wonder, are they, they owned by the same people? Do y'all know that? Do you know, do you know? Oh, so Javara said yes, too cute for crafting. That's a cute name. Said yes. Mimi's creation said, I'm just the only one. They saying over here on TikTok, they know all about it. You said you can't cut neither Shamika. Girlfriend, I be, I be struggling. They have it here in Chicago. So I am... I'm from Detroit, Michigan, and we don't, we, it wasn't none in there because I guess it's not a small town, but now I'm in Arizona, surprise Arizona, and they don't have it here either. I guess that's just, it just depends on where you live. Just like they be having the tacos and the chicken together. I don't know, in the same building. <laughs> It's in the small towns. Dollar Trees have Dollar Tree Plus aisle in each one. Really? Lakeisha said our Dollar Trees have Dollar Tree Pluses in every single aisle. And she's in Mobile, Alabama. Okay. And everybody around here trying to look for a Dollar Tree Plus and you got them all. That's why we can't find them because they, they all in Mobile, Alabama. <laughs> Family Dollar owns Dollar Tree. Does it? I've heard of it in Columbus. Most of our family dollars have turned into Dollar Tree. Deborah, she said, where? She from Chicago. She from Chi-Town too now. She said, where they at? Where are they at? I like that. Too cute for crafting. Says, we crafters don't cut straight. We just have to be creative. Girl, we'll put a pearl or a rhinestone somewhere. <laughs> I love hiding stuff. I'll be like, they'll never know. Y'all remember that video that came out? Be like, they'll never know. They'll never know. They'll never know. I'm probably saying it wrong. Y'all know I'm corny. Where was it? How'd it go? Who's going to know? Who's going to know? I don't even remember how I went. Y'all probably laughing at me. I don't be knowing. I don't be knowing. We almost done. The hardest part is cutting them out, right? Oh, so Deborah said they're in Dollar Trees are adding all the dollar plus in their aisles. You know what? I can really see them doing that because it's more money. It's like five and ten dollar items and stuff that I've seen. Venezia said in Texas, some Dollar Tree and Family Dollars are connected in one store. Yep, that's what they're saying. That's crazy. Crazy. 
Well, I was saying, like, for this project, y'all, you almost got to cut straight because it's on a slant. So it's hard when you got a crooked eye like me. <laughs> and um, we trying to cut straight, but we cutting straight on a slant. That didn't even make sense, but it made sense. Like, when I put this template together, it literally had to put, put the slants together. How will they know? That's what it is. Thank you, Lakeisha. We'll know it's crooked. The customer be like, oh, my God. I know y'all always laughing at me. So <laughs> Janice said, uh, the customer will never know. But that's why I said we are good to put a rhinestone in a place that it don't go to make it look cute. Throw a bow on top of that sucker. You know, we know how to cover up some things. That's why we are crafters, right? Problem when I get the template, I will try to put the picture on it in Canva. Can't size it correctly. And when I printed it out, it was big and it did not fit. All right. So, Nikki. When I'm done, I probably, because I'm going to be talking and I'll be forgetting a lot. So, Nikki, before I get off this um, live, I'm going to go into Canva. If y'all can remind me, and I will show you how to do that. I will show you how to size that right quick. All right. So, this one is our big one for our back wall, right? And it's for our back wall. Man, this camera on my computer is is bugging because over here on TikTok is giving me all the pretty colors. I don't know about over here. It ain't giving on Facebook. Right? Like Deborah, it's like they turn it into a five below and more, right? In Northridge, a couple blocks from the hip mall. Oh, okay. <laughs> right, I for real will forget. No lies. I'm going to try not to. Why well, I can't get this? Okay, here we go. I cut it with my Cricut so my hands disobey. Yeah, but look, for this, Lakeisha, your cameo is not going to cut Cricut for you. <laughs> and this is Cricut. It, it, the template is Cricut because the thing is Cricut. So, you know. So for here, this one, let me pull y'all down. You want to put it underneath the top, the little, what do you call these things? The little spout. And kind of just eye it on each side. I could have went up a little bit further. I could have, but it's on there and I don't care. And it folds over perfectly, y'all. Folds over perfectly. All right. And remember, we have these little wings back here. Because we have a little bit of overage back here. Thank you, Deborah. And look, my hands are getting ink on them. Because I did not seal this. I don't know if y'all can see them black fingers. My hands are getting ink on them. Um, and that's because it's not sealed. Hey, Billy, can you come get your kids, please? Them kids is being terrible, y'all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So this is what we have so far, y'all. This is what we have so far. We're doing good. We're doing good. And it's fitting perfectly. We just have to cut some edges off, right? Thank you, Shamika. I know. Come get your kids. The school better come get their kids. That's what better happen. They started last Thursday. Then they went Friday. And they're going back Monday, which will be tomorrow. <laughs> They're going. I promise you they're going. Yes. Yeah, so I just, I ran out of my triple thick because I had so many of the other ones to do. So that's why I didn't seal this one. No. No. 
Okay, am I back on here? Y'all still see me, TikTok? I got alarms going off. Can you do this with the Eco Tank printer as well? Yep, it, the Eco Tank is a inkjet printer, Nikki. That's what I used. That's what I used. I don't know if y'all can see it. That's my Eco Tank printer right, right there. That's a Eco Tank twenty seven sixty. So that's what I used to print these out. Wait. <laughs> hey, y'all want to see something funny? I'm on TikTok here, and I'm showing TikTok the camera to my Eco Tank. And Nikki, you're right here on Facebook or on uh <laughs> on youtube and i'm showing tiktok the printer but i can't turn my computer around but yes hon i'm using the eco tank 2760 the epson oh wait that was funny all right so this is the back it says in memory of <laughs> in memory of I know I didn't do this one for the five. I did them differently. Now you got to go buy a Dollar Tree one. So, yeah, mine, mine started school yesterday, um, last week. They started super early. So for this one, remember, we have that little lip on it up there. So I'm going to try to get it down on the lip so we can just fold it down. Let me move you down, TikTok, so you can see. Ah, look, if it's, it's, no, no, I'm trying to adjust. No, no, it's like sticky, y'all. Uh. No, don't you rip on me. The devil is a lie. No, no, it tore a little bit, y'all. Jesus, oh. Oh. I'm not matching today, y'all, just so y'all know. Don't come for me, okay? I was just being around the house today. Maintenance box for the printer. Mine's is saying something about an ink pad. Nope, that's not the same thing. Never heard of that one, Shamika. Has anybody heard of something called an ink pad going bad? Definitely have to either seal it some type of way. So this one is all curled up, y'all, now, because I just got it stuck. Trying to adjust TikTok. So I'm just going to try and put this underneath this lip right here. And let it flow, let it flow. Right down, now my hands are going to be even worse. And then I'm going to just push that top down. Just roll it on down. Actually, this side is going to have to be cut with the X-Acto knife. So if y'all can see, it's not my crooked eye. It's small on the top, big on the bottom. Small on the top, big on the bottom. Again, I told you I never put this together. I just knew that it worked. Yeah, what's going on with it? Is it getting saturated with ink, Shamika? What's happening? Oh, I got all these messages on here, y'all. I'm sorry. I didn't even see y'all TikTok. Thank y'all for the rose. Hey, Chrissy, that's my poo. They better come get their kids. But so Untouched Customs, it's not the maintenance box. She said it's the ink pad. Never heard of the ink pad. She said it was pulling my paper through. So it was printing as if it was on paper, on the paper. That's weird. I had to take some very hot water and a syringe to clean it. So that's a good one. I use magic, is it magic bullet from Amazon and a syringe and I push that solution through and it breaks it up every single time. It's called magic, 
magic something. I think it's magic bullet. Ink, on claw, printer, cleaner. Can you guys hear me on TikTok? Because somebody said they can't hear me. Can you? Yeah, okay, magic bullet. Can y'all hear me on Facebook? Hey, Cheryl. Okay, so hopefully she just needs to get go out and come back in because they can hear me. Yeah, I love the magic bullet. Um, actually, it's right here. Here's the magic bullet right here. It don't sound right. They'll do it. This is the magic bullet. It's solution. It's print head on blocked. Magic bullet. Um, and then it comes with this syringe with a um, clear piece on it. And you just suck it on out. And then you push this back through. Oh, no, you're fine, Shamika. We all having fun and talking. We crafting and talking. My hands is getting inky. Okay, so I don't know which way these go. this one goes. I don't remember. I think I put rest in peace on the back. Nope, it doesn't fit. So rest in peace goes on this side. Now, the si these sides on the bottom are right, are the same. So it can go on either side. Okay. So then I just put this one with the sparkles goes on the front where you can put the name and then the ones with the gems and the pearls can go on the back. Okay. So I'm just going to lay them in their spots. Let's get this front one done first. Lanise, no, it doesn't. It does not. No, nope. you should have been at the first beginning of my life. This one for the um, Dollar Tree is told the the images and the sizing is totally different. These are time consuming, and that's why I've seen them for twenty five to thirty five dollars. Even though, um, even though we pay five dollars on them, like. Get y'all money for these things, and they're small, but that's what we do. We custom make things, and they do. But this is not the same. Nope, I don't like how this is fitting on here. Maybe it's this way to get a better fit. You seen them $45. Now that's a little price gougy. I do them for 30, 25 or 30. Yeah, I've been doing 25. Cricut sticker paper is very thick. Other paper is better. Cricut printable paper. So Nikki, I have a bunch of paper, but my 2760 will not pull through. And I have a bunch of paper. Um, I have um I'm just going to keep putting these on. These sides are the same. Uh, it won't take um, for those um, clear, uh, what do you call those things? Those ornaments, the trans paper. What is that clear paper, y'all, that goes through the um, printers? I can't get none of that to go through. Some cardstock will come through, some won't. You want to take this one all the way to the top of that lip, y'all. All the way up until you can't put it up anymore. And I'm having some overage, y'all, right there. You just got to use the X-Acto knife and cut them off. Transparent paper. Thank you. 
I have a lot of paper that won't go through this 2760. So I definitely understand that. Ah, I dropped it. Now, the only thing that was the same on this was this bottom piece, the right and the left. That was the only thing that was the same. I seen some people on Etsy that had these. My template, my templates are $9.99 to $12.99, depending on the one that you get. And some people had them on there for $5. No explanation. Here's the memorial template. Here's the sizes that they probably stole from somebody else. I'd be so frustrated with that, y'all. Because people was buying a template, I'm sure, $5. Oh, I'm going to buy a $5 template before I buy a $12 template. But they don't have instructions on how to do them, and they're not coming out right. And you've wasted $5. The 2415000 will won't go through neither. I have the 15,000, but I use it for eco solvent. So I haven't tried that one. That's a good one. Shannon says, have you tried taping it to the printer paper on the top and feed it in and painters tape on the top too? No, Shabby Chic, it wasn't water slide. It was transparency. The transparency, it wouldn't take it through. So, Lanice, I was telling them on a live earlier, it's called the Dollar Tree Plus. The Dollar Tree Plus. You have to find a Dollar Tree Plus. That's who has these. You, it, They're not just the regular Dollar Tree. So, um, Shannon, that's a good point. I did do the transparency paper like that, and mine still wouldn't take through, though. But because I think somebody else told me that. So I tried it because I was trying to do those memorial um, ornaments during Christmas time. And it just wasn't not loving me. All right. So these fit, right? There is overage on all four corners. So what you can do is either fold them down and around, right? Or... Or you can cut them off with the X-Acto knife. Or cut them off with, I, for me, I'm just going to fold them under. But it's some overage right here on the sides too. I don't think it's making a difference. I'm just folding it on over. And you're not even being able to tell nothing. You can't tell no difference of anything. I do see a little something. So this one I put together and I should have, let me see if I could pull it apart. Oh yeah. Hey, Sonia. This one is the back. So, and it has words on it. So I'm going to lift this up a little bit. I like this printable vinyl because it is like, it's forgiving. So have y'all ever got some sticker paper that was not forgiving? So I folded this one down, right? To push this one over the top of it because it has words on it. To make that corner nice and neat. Hey, Shamisha. I'm going to do this one the same way. Let me peel this back and peel this one because it has words on it. I'm going to read y'all comments in a minute. Have y'all joined my free Facebook group over here on TikTok? I know people come in and out of TikTok. Y'all keep hearing me say it, Facebook and YouTube. StreamYard gives me the ability to go live at the same time on everything but TikTok. 
So you can cut around these and lay it down. It'll lay down better if you probably put it like a little slit there. But for right now, just for this tutorial, I don't care because there's nothing even on here. I'm just doing this for y'all. But there's nothing wrong to me for just folding it under. The customer is not going to look under there. And if they do, I mean, to turn it on and off, it just it doesn't look bad as long as it's nice and neat, right? Yeah. Like that bad sticker paper, this vinyl stuff, that's why I like this. And I didn't mind sealing it because other brands, they whack, man. You put that stuff down, you cannot pull it up. Lakeisha, it is um, Shabby Chic. Can you put down my uh, free Facebook group down? Yep. Yeah. There you go. It's called Triple Thick Rust-Oleum or Cryline. Triple Thick, it comes in Rust-Oleum or Cryline brand. You can get it from Home Depot, Michaels, um, Walmart sells this as well. Shabby Chic, where you at? She'll drop it. She be coming in and out. That's my ad man over there. Hey, Brandy. All right, y'all. So this is this is it. Now there's some little pieces on here that I would fold down one before the other. Like this one just has print, so I would fold this down and then this side right here fold it over the top of it, or vice versa. There she goes. She just put it on there. Thank you. So that's my free Facebook group. You guys go ahead and join so you guys can see this replay. So somebody is asking if they get the template, will they be able to use it in the sign space? Uh, Lean, I got it from Amazon. Amazon. Okay. Yay. We'll love to have you over there. So as far as um, if you can, if you know how to do the cricket hack, um, it's the beta, not the cricket. They call it the cricket it hack but it's the beta mode so if you know how to print in beta mode you can do it in Cricut design space and you want to print eight and a half by 11. if you don't print eight and a half by 11 your paper has to be exactly eight and a half by 11 for the template to be the exact size for it to work. My Canyon ink is water resistant and I don't need to seal it. Amazing. You got eco solvent ink, Cheryl? Yep, keep it in your shopping cart. It is good. It is good. So Brandy, if you know how to do that, um, that in design space, then yes then yes. But you see, everybody that's been having issues, my template works perfectly. Oh, I forgot to cut the back. That's why it's a bubble. Hold on. Here's my X-Acto knife. I'm just going to go in. Y'all, this is not nice and neat. This is not nice and neat, but you just cut out their little hole. Cut out the hole. And there you go. My hole is crooked. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. Make sure when you guys are designing this, you guys may and put a name or something back there. You guys make sure. There you go, Nikki. I forgot. All right. I'm going to go over to Canva and show Nikki um, how to um, size it right quick. All right. Let's go on over to Canva. Um, let me open it up.
Oh, you do, Joanne? Am I sharing my screen? Hold on, I might have to reshare. Let me make sure my screen is coming. It's coming, I believe. I'm going to flip you guys around in one second. TikTok, as soon as I make sure that I'm sharing with Facebook. Let me uh, hit present, share screen, entire screen, share. Let's go into Canva. I'm looking over here at my other phone just to make sure I'm in Canva. Okay. All right. So let me turn you guys around. TikTok. All right, so, <laughs> yay, we see the screen. All right, so once you guys bring it into um, TikTok. Now, I have a video up in my free Facebook group. I'm not going to go through bringing it in, how to add a photo, how to add text, because I've already done that, and that is in my free Facebook group, okay? All right. So what I'm going to do now is I am going to go to projects. No, I'm going back home. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay. So here I did this one. This is my pet one that I did for my pet. My dog that passed away. I have this template is available as well. Y'all. Okay. So what you want to do here is once you click on it and you bring this template in, you have um, nodes on the side here. Y'all see how that I added those pictures in, so they're right there. So on the notes, you will see right now it says 10.4 by is your width and your height is 8.1. If you print like that, you will not get a good um, print. It's going to be, your sizes are going to be off. It has to be 11 by eight and a half. Okay. So I'm holding it and it says with 11 height, eight and a half, just like eight and a half by 11, but eight and a half by 11 is portrait where it's going to be up and down. This one is landscape where it goes across and it's 11 by eight and a half. So 10.7 is not going to work. 11.2 is not going to work. 10.6 is not going to work. You have to make sure that it is eight and a half by 11. Okay. Once you have that to the right size, y'all, you're just going to go to share and you're going to go to download. And you can then save it as a PNG or a JPEG, okay? The rest of the video is up in the group, but that is the portion that she had a question on. So that's 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 what it is, y'all. That's what it is. You're welcome, Nikki. You're welcome. When I stretch it, it cuts the photo off. So yeah, as long as you grab those nodes, Nikki, you will be fine. You will be fine. Let me um stop sharing. Go back to StreamYard. All right. Does anybody have any questions before we get off of here? Hopefully that answered you guys and you guys are able to do your Memorial Fountain, the crooked <laughs> Memorial Fountain from the Dollar Tree, the ones that couldn't do the other one. OK, so I just tried to help solve your problem. Um, I'm glad to help you guys. Um, I try to help when I can. Um. And if you guys watch my TikTok, um, I do teach beginners Photoshop courses. So um, my signups are the first through the fifth of every month. So starting Monday through, is that Friday? And I'll be going live a couple of times. Um, 
talking about my courses and things like that, you guys can go to my link pop, linkpop.com forward slash blanks by CSU, and you can learn all about my courses. Um, and y'all make sure on TikTok, y'all get into my free Facebook group so you guys can see the replay and um, you guys can, um, you know, learn, learn. I do want to tell y'all one thing. They did come with the rocks. And I didn't make this to go all the way down purposely because once you get the rocks and the water and stuff in there, this doesn't show anyway. Okay. So I kind of made it to go up and that's it. You know, that's all y'all need. That's all y'all need. Put a little rocks on there. And I, I got some cuter rocks. The Dollar Tree, I got them from somewhere else, but the Dollar Tree had a whole rock section, had a whole rock wall that was cute. Thank you, Janice. Yes, put 11 for the width and eight and a half height for the inches. It will automatically do landscape because it was made in landscape. But so you just have to make sure it says 11 and a half um, width by height, um, eight and a half by H by eight and a half. You're welcome. You're welcome, welcome, welcome. So hopefully that helped y'all, helped y'all, helped y'all. Y'all have any more questions? Y'all could just reach out to me. Enough, enough of y'all have been reaching out to me in my inbox and my um, has been on jam about these things. And um, it has been on, um, y'all have been emailing me like crazy because y'all could not get this particular template. Um, Key Babe, yes. I, this is the Dollar Tree one I have, and this one is the five below. They're two separate templates because they're different sizes. So, yes, if you go up to the top of the group um, or, or the page, you'll see my website up there. And then don't forget to join my free Facebook group in there, and you can see the replay on how to do this. I do offer one-on-one, -on -one, Shanna. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. I do offer one-on-ones. That's on my link pop as well. Linkpop.com, blanks by CSU. You'll find all of the stuff. My website is blanksbycsu.com. But on if you go through like the link pop, it has the fountains right at the top for you. But I offer so many things on my um website. So many things. Hey, craft crack, craft crack glitter. I ain't seen you in a while. You're welcome. You're welcome. All right. So if you guys are not in the Facebook group, you got to go over there. See that? Y'all have a great evening. Enjoy the rest of y'all Sunday because I know I am. I've been teaching for a while. Y'all have a fantabulous night. And y'all remember to stay busy as a bee. Good night.